Hey, this is The Muffin here. So just a quick reminder, you can save 20% on all your World of Tank Splits purchases by downloading the Amazon App Store app. The instructions are just in my previous video. I'll add the link below so you guys can see that. Along with the actual links, if you're in the US to click on those, and if you're in the UK to click on those and just follow the steps, download it, and it's really nice 20% savings. So let's get on with our video. All right, we're gonna be doing an experiment. This was actually one of my own crazy ideas. Blitz bowling. Gonna be doing a bunch of tier ones. I think in normal bowling, I think there's like nine or 10 pins or something like that. What is there, four on the bottom, then three, two, and then one. Uh, anyway, but we're having the tier ones be the pins. We're having the tier 10 tanks be the bowling balls. We're gonna try to find out how many bowling balls does it take to wipe out enough bowling pins. Doing a bunch of different maps. This one, Copperfield right at the beginning. We're just trying to see, okay, what can a mouse do? We actually had noticed some things that were quite interesting here. Mouse is getting ready. The bowling ball is rolling. Here it goes. <laughs> this was just fun to see. Clearly we could not packed ourselves close enough together to really get that destruction we wanted. So now we're, we're adding a couple more tier 10s. Here goes the first bowling ball, the leopard. And yeah, not a whole lot. We just now have the other tier 10s. They're gonna go ahead and just charge, see what they can do. The leopard was supposed to move like a bowling ball would have. But, uh, the leopard got stuck. So we just went ahead and just had the other bowling balls just go ahead. Just goes over, down, and not as many as you would think. Now we did do a couple different things to cause more destruction later on. We kind of figured out how to do this a little bit better. So yeah, you're gonna see that here real soon. So this one, we just had three completely sail over. And surprisingly enough, when it came to tier 10 ramming and landing on tier one, the outcome wasn't as good as I had expected. We're using Normandy now as these steep hills to allow these tier 10s to really try and get some good speed coming down and just see what they can do to these bowling pins. So we did have a couple that got knocked out. Now, what I was saying earlier about one of the things we noticed, even though you have friendly fire on, the friendly tier 10 that's ramming the tier one doesn't do nearly as many damage as if you were to ram a normal enemy, which I thought was really interesting. Sometimes one of those things you don't necessarily notice unless you're in a training room, because in a normal game, you don't really have friendly fire. Now, that was actually <laughs> kind of surprising. We did have to have the tier one tanks come out in front after some of them got destroyed to make sure that, okay, they are able to try and get destroyed because when a destroyed tank was in front of, um, other healthy tanks or that tanks were still alive bowling pins even though the tier 10 would ram the dead tank and push it into the tier 1 pin it wouldn't do anything so this one became a little bit more challenging but in the final one we did right after this that really worked and helped us get a strike was we had all tier 10 bowling balls uh, go right over the cliffs of Normandy down on top of all the pins and you're gonna see that here real soon Here goes the next one charging and 
just not quite the amount of destruction that I was expecting for a tier 10 getting speed going down a hill and just ramming a bunch of tier 1 tanks. So that was just, this is the last one here. Yeah, and it's just funny, you can see how much friendly ramming does, and it's not very much compared to uh, an enemy ram. Now here we go, this is the strike we finally got. Just look at this destruction. <laughs> Once we had the Yak Panzer 100 land down on some of these tier 10s, finally was able to do it. Now it looks like there is maybe one. Oh, it's actually frozen. <laughs> okay, I'm not exactly sure what happened, but we did get a strike. So anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this vid. This is the muffin here. You guys stay cool and keep tanking.